Hi guys, welcome back to Fragments of a Simple Life, for every video I make it super simple. Today I'm going to be doing some favorite day haunted friends um, Halloween cookies. I got this from Target a while ago, but I've never done it, or I haven't done it yet. So I figured why not give it a try now. So we have uh, different kinds of cookies, a total of eight that are ready to decorate. They've already been baked. It includes the cookies, pre-made icing, and candy for decorating. It says it's frightfully fun. If you look at all of these cookies and you see how wonderfully they're decorated, mine will not turn out like any of this. Um, I'm not good at this. We are just doing this for fun. I am not a baker. So I'm gonna pause, take everything out of the box so we can look at it and then we'll start decorating. Okay guys, there will be some crinkle sounds as I show you the stuff that it came with. We have some black sugar. We have some like larger sprinkles that are black, white, orange, and purple. We have a white frosting. It's one of those like, little twist off tips. It never works right though. It looks like we have two purple frostings. Um, I guess it doesn't come with black frosting. Either that or someone made a mistake. Orange frosting. So that's those. And then we have all the different cookies. We have kitty cat with a jack-o-lantern, a ghost, a bat, it looks a little bit messed up down here and then pumpkins I have some scissors and I have a paper plate like I always do for the mess let me go ahead and cut these out and then we'll start I'll try to do three or four of these with you guys today I like to save some if I can to offer my kids the opportunity. Sometimes they say yes, sometimes they say no. Let's start with a pumpkin because that seems easy. Let me grab my plate here. I'm gonna like give it a little light dusting. Now, it, we don't have all the colors that you would think of for a pumpkin. So we're just gonna do the best we can. Let's start with orange, probably a good place to start to color the pumpkin. I can try to twist it off, but, oh, it is gonna go, that's nice. Now, sometimes when it comes off, it doesn't come out. So let's try. It looks like it's separated a little bit. See, nothing's coming out. <laughs> I'm gonna cut it again. Just keep cutting it until it actually starts to come out. There we go. Yeah, see, it like separated and it's kind of jelly looking. And we're gonna just kind of spread it while we have a chance. I know I could like flood it and all this kind of stuff. I just, I bake the cookies for my kids like at Christmas, but I let them be the ones that decorate. <laughs> I'm gonna go like around the stem like this. It already doesn't wanna come out anymore. Okay. I'm gonna go down these like decorative lines with a different color. Um, probably purple because there's so much of it. Okay, I did forget a knife this time. In the past, I usually would bring a butter knife, but I completely forgot, so we'll see how we do without it. Now it's starting to come out right, kind of, a little gunky. I'm gonna kind of like mix it like this to get it to spread. Okay, that's not bad. Wow, 
know. It's not good either. It's tripping down the side. But it's okay. Let's keep going. I'll go around this edge. And like this. <laughs> it's horrific. Don't look. I just took my dog for a nice long walk. It's morning where I am. We're getting fall weather. Today there was even a little bit of like misty, foggy sprinkles. And not just the best. There really is. So she is loving it. Even my husband stopped working this morning because sometimes he works from home. Well, he usually works from home actually. So he stopped working for a little bit for 30 minutes just to come with us. And get some exercise. See the texture difference? That part wasn't mixed up. I probably should have tried to warm it up in my hands. It's because now the pumpkin is like two different textures. It's okay. We're going to use the side of it to spread. Spread it out. I don't think my son is going to care as he uh, puts it in his mouth and eats it. I'm just going to go back and forth like this and then spread it. Bakers, please don't get mad at me. I also bake, but I like making stuff like uh, oatmeal cookies and like yummy muffins and, you know, chocolate chip cookies from scratch. You know, apple crumble. That's more my vibe than like cute little holiday cookies. Those kind of things I buy. <laughs> Good. I feel like I'm going to run out of orange already. Maybe I shouldn't have chosen this one. Okay. Almost there. Yeah, but I have a neighbor when I was walking my dog and they bought this. I don't know if you guys have seen it in your neighborhoods, but they bought this huge skeleton that looks like it's coming out of their roof. I mean, huge, but it's like an optical illusion or whatever to make it look like it's coming out of the roof. Oh, that is just so atrocious. I feel so bad. Look how bad that is. <laughs> It looks like when you're making macaroni and cheese in a box and you don't mix the cheese good. That's what it looks like. Look, if anything, this is ASMR that you can laugh to, okay? It's tradition. We have to watch me fail at this like every year. Okay, I'm going to do the purple. I'm just going to cut it because it sucks. <laughs> Put the trash to the side. Yeah, it's like dripping really bad. Oh well, well. Look at this super straight line I'm doing. Psych. Oh God. It's so bad, you guys. Please don't be mad at me. Get off. <laughs> it's just... It's just the worst. It really is. Okay, I'm going to put purple up here. Like this. Go like this with it. Oh yeah, it's totally a pumpkin. It's not my fault this frosting sucks. I don't know. I don't know. It's just... I think I'm gonna do the leaf and then maybe I'll do the leaf in white and then we'll put some sprinkles on it <laughs> cause that'll help it. Nope. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Mm. Oh, there's a big air bubble on this one. 
Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm just going to fill it in. Yeah. And then we'll put some, some sprinkles. I'm going to open this one. I'm going to put some of these on that leaf. Just kind of like smash them on. You can't tell it's a leaf anymore anyways, so might as well, right? Smash. Oh my gosh. What a mess. There. <laughs> okay. I'm going to put the sprinkles right here, like off to the side, because we can use those later for the next one. Should I do a little black sprinkles? Why not? Now, these sprinkles, just warn you guys, they will dye my hand. So, if it bothers you that my hand is, like, dirty, I'm sorry, but they are going to dye my hand. Should we give it, like, some eyeballs? With the, sprinkler, with the sprinkles? One eyeball. <laughs> it's not exactly triangle shape, is it? It does look like eyeballs, though. Oh, it looks sad for some reason. Should we give it like a mouth? I'll give it like a straight across mouth. Not exactly jack o' lantern vibes, but like I said, my son and my daughter will eat it regardless. They don't care what it looks like. Okay, that's not bad. Redemption. I'm making a mess. Okay. <laughs> well. It's a, uh, it's something, you guys. It's a hot mess. Jesus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're going to put it on the cute plate. There. It's not that bad. Okay, it's not that bad. Let's move it along. Let's do... Um, let's do the ghost. Okay. Ghosts are white, so, so I guess we should start with that. She has a bow, so I think it's supposed to be a girl. Allegedly. I feel like we had this one last time. Sometimes it seems like they're different and sometimes not so much. Okay. I think that's pretty good. I mean, for me, that's pretty good. I'll fill it in with as much white as I can. And then maybe with the purple, I'll do her bow and the little, like, accent lines down here. I'll do that. And then try to give her some eyeballs with the sprinkles. All right, I'm just going to go back and forth like this. And then I'm going to take the tip of it and spread it out. This one has a lot of frosting. <laughs> That's okay. Oops. Oops again. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad for this cheap little thing of frosting. It's making noises at me. Okay, let's spread it again. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna run out of frosting for reals. Oh well. If we have to make one that's all purple with sprinkles all over it, then we have to do what we have to do, right? Mm. 
Okay. I lost the lines. I totally covered them up, but that's okay. Now we're going to do purple. Give her a bow. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> oh my god, it's just really bad. There's one side of the bow. There's two sides of the bow. And then we'll do orange in the middle. Because it's the only other color we have. Like this. Okay, it's kind of a bow. <laughs> Ish. Let's see. Kind of a bow? Not really, huh? I tried. Okay. So now, um, let's give her some purple eyeballs. Like this. One. And two. Cute. Oh, I forgot to do the details. Well, maybe we'll do more than two lines. Like one, two, and then this one was like shorter, huh? Three. That's cute. Should we give her a smile? Okay. Let's do, I have mostly green right here, so we'll do a green smile. We'll start with one dot like that. This might be really bad, guys. Two. Three. Well, she's not really smiling, but it's something. We'll try to go up right there. <laughs> then... Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. I mean, it does look like I'm five, but it's not bad. I'm proud. Look at her. She's super cute. She's a mess, but we love her, right? Okay, let's add her to the plate with her pumpkin friend. <laughs> Scoot over, pumpkin. Oh my gosh. It's only kind of a disaster. Okay, let's see who's next. I'm gonna do the bat, you guys. This one's kind of messed up. Hold on. Oops, I hit my tripod. Okay. This little fell is better. They have lots of crumbs on them. All right, we're gonna do a purple bat because I have a ton of purple. Um, and we haven't done one yet that's like mostly purple. So I'm really just gonna go in with like his whole body being purple. Maybe I'll do the inside of his ears like white or something and give him an orange nose, but the face and everything is all gonna be purple. Okay. Not bad for me. Okay. And we're going. Okay, he has some sort of shape so far. I know they're all going to have orange on the back of them from that stupid pumpkin, but it's okay. That's why we have the paper plate. When I was a kid, I've told this story before, but for anybody who's new or doesn't remember, when I was a kid, my, I won't say what religion, because I won't, I don't want to call people out or make them mad, but I'll just say my mom practiced a religion that does not celebrate any holidays. I'm sure you guys can fill in the blanks. And so I never did anything like this. There was, I don't have any like family traditions of like, making and decorating sugar cookies and my mom would be in the kitchen baking sugar cookies and then she would give us all the frosting and sprinkles to decorate them that's not a thing that's not a memory for me so being able to do this with you guys i just want to say thank you because it's like i don't know even though i'm 41 years old it's like the little kid inside of me gets to live out all these little things that i never got to do it's very healing, even if I suck at it. 
And now you know why I suck at it. <laughs> because the only time I do this is with my kids during the holidays, but I mostly let them do it. Or making videos with you. So, I like it. I did an okay job of doing the little flooding line, and and now anything that I did, I'm going to ruin it. Ooh, we should put the black sugar all over this one. Black and purple pat. I'm probably going to try to make videos a little more often going into the rest of the month because I have a lot of... Uh, video ideas left that involve Halloween and I feel like the end of October is rapidly approaching I'm like no I'm just gonna put another line like that okay cute um okay should we do the whole face I guess so huh? except for his nose I'm just gonna literally go around and around To spread it a little bit. At this point, I'm probably not saving enough frosting for my kids to do these cookies or enough frosting for me to even finish these cookies, but that's okay. I can see somebody walking right outside my house. They're probably like, what is she doing? She's talking to herself with a camera. It was a very cloudy day today, so I have lots of windows open. Okay, so we're done with that. Let's give him a nose or her. I'm not judging. Bloop. Okay. Let's do some white eyes to make it creepy. Like that. Bloop. <laughs> I'm going to do some sprinkles, black sprinkles. All over his whole entire body. What a disaster. I'm trying to put him on his face too, but not his nose. Okay. Oh my gosh. Don't worry guys, I'm going to dust it off. Or tap it off, I should say. Ready? Oh, I was really hoping that more would come off than that, but it did not. Oh, his eye moved. Okay. What did I do? It's okay. It's okay. And then we'll put some white in his ears. Bloop. Bloop. <laughs> That's ugly. But I like it. Okay, these ones are slowly starting to dry, which is good. And we'll put this here. Aw, they're like a little trio. Let's do one last one. Okay. The last one is the cat that's coming out of a pumpkin. I'm kind of scared of this one, I think. Of all the ones I could possibly mess up, this one's going to get it bad. Let's start with whatever orange we have left, and we'll do the pumpkin. Um, and then the mouth, maybe with, I don't know, white. We can do some sprinkles. Oh, I know the trick. You do the mouth first, right? And the eyeballs? Okay, let's try that. Okay. It's not going to look like a triangle at all, but it's going to be a mouth one way or the other. Nope. That's not bad. Should we leave his mouth open? Like he's laughing? No, huh? Just cover it up as much as we can. 
and then we'll do the black sprinkles and then hopefully he'll have the black um, eyes and mouth and the white frosting will be covered up. Yeah, that's not great. I'm trying to just fill in. Well, it does not look like a jack lantern mouth anymore, but we're going to just go with it. We're going to use these. Uh, black sprinkles, the sugar sprinkles, on what we just did and hope for the best. I just like doing that. I know it's too much. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. What a mess. Oh my gosh. I need like one of those brushes. Those pastry brushes. Okay. Well, it's something. It's definitely something. Maybe I'll just make some lines like a pumpkin because I really am running out of orange. Holy crap, that's the straightest line I've ever made. Wow. It's never going to happen again. There's one line. And two lines. We'll do kind of down the middle, going like this. Oh great, he looks like a baseball. It's a jack-o'-lantern baseball, you guys. Holy mackerel. Okay. We'll do the cat now. Gonna go with purple for the cat. Dude, there is dogs that have been crying all day outside. I don't know what neighbor it is, but they're howling a lot. It's kind of making me worried. That's a little cat hand. I can't really tell, but it, like a cat hand, a paw, hello. I said cat hand. Okay. Neat. Now, hmm, maybe give it some white dots inside of its ears. The white is like literally almost gone, unfortunately. Bloop, bloop. Okay. Now, we can give it a face. Maybe like this with a... Dot. I'm going to put some eyes on it. Like that. Some whiskers. Hmm, this looks like an otter. <laughs> what? It's a bear. I made a bear. I made a cat bear. I was trying to save frosting for my kids by not filling it in this time, but... I have made a distinguished gentleman be like bear. Oh, now it's worse. Now the cat has no nose. Okay. Let's give it a little like orange dot or something. I don't know. Oh my God, it's a clown now. I made a clown. Yep. Yep, yep. And this is horrendous. <laughs> Please don't judge me. It's so bad. I don't know how to fix it. It's unfixable. Who is this? What is this? What have I done? Oh, wow. 
I think the white inside the ears just makes it worse. It's too late. I can't make it into a triangle shape. It's like already getting thick. Holy moly. It's really bad. I'm sorry. I'm just going to leave it like that. Big, I can hear my daughter now. She's going to be like, Mom, what is that supposed to be? And I'm going to say, a bear, obviously, because when you think of Halloween, you think of bears. Duh. Okay, guys. Here's my cookies. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching me. <laughs> this is like a tradition of ours at this point. Um, me just absolutely destroying these cookies and doing worse job than my kids ever could. I think I will uh, save the rest for them. We do have a whole tube of purple left, and that's about it. The other tubes are just about gone. Um, I'm proud of my lines going around the outside edge of the pumpkin and of this one. And that's about it. This is like a depressed pumpkin. She looks like she's on something. This, I went too far with the sprinkles. And this one, I know I probably definitely should have filled it in in some way. I made a baseball pumpkin <laughs> but thanks for joining me you guys i can't even eat these because i don't eat gluten so i'm going to save them for my kids but doing it is loads of fun and i appreciate you coming along for this emotional journey with me <laughs> if you want to see more from me please like comment and subscribe i do have a bunch more halloween stuff to get through i have another halloween magazine I have some more scary story magazines. Um, I have some coloring book pages, more stickers. I have to paint a haunted house that lights up, which I haven't even done yet. So I have a whole bunch of other things I got to do for you guys. So uh, keep watching and I appreciate you. I'll see you next time. Bye.